Hello friends, few days back I received this box from Arduino. I am very excited to see what we have inside. So let's unboxing it. Yes, you guessed right my friends. This is the newly launched IoT development board from Arduino. It's Arduino Nano ESP32. Now let's see about the specifications of Arduino ESP32. It has ESP32 S3 microcontroller on board. It also has Wi-Fi and Bluetooth inbuilt. This microcontroller has very high clock speed of 240 MHz. It has the same form factor of Arduino Nano. It means you can easily replace your Arduino Nano with this Arduino Nano ESP32 board. But keep in mind that IO pins are 3.3 tolerant. So get ready friends, we are ready to try Arduino Nano ESP32 for the very first time. And yes, we will try most popular blink test. This board also have a on board LED connected to pin 13. But I am going to connect external LED on pin 13 for better visibility. Pin declaration is same as we are doing for Arduino Nano. After writing the code, selecting proper boards and COM port, we can easily upload code to the board. So friends, as of now, we have learned what is Arduino Nano ESP32 board is and managed to run a basic LED code. Now it's time to move towards the application for which Arduino Nano ESP32 board is designed for. Yes, home automation and IoT applications. Uh, in this video, we will try a home automation project using Arduino IoT Cloud. So let's get started. So first of all, go to the Arduino Cloud IoT web application. Then after we have to configure our device. Right now we are using Arduino Nano ESP32 board. After that we will configure the Wi-Fi credential. Then after that uh, we are going to declare the variables which we are going to use in our program. After completing the variable declaration, it's time to edit some code. Here in the code, I am declaring the digital pins which we are going to use. So as of now our coding is ready, uh, we are ready to upload the code to the board. So after finishing uploading the code, it's time to develop a dashboard. So, so in the dashboard option, we are uh, choosing some widget to control uh, our LEDs, motors and servo motors etc. So our dashboard is also completed. Uh, now I am using this my multi-purpose PCB for this project. 
बिकॉज अर्लियर दिस पी सी बी आई एम यूजिंग विद आर्ड्यूनो नैनो एंड दिस आर्ड्यूनो नैनो ई एस पी थर्टी टू बोर्ड इज हंड्रेड परसेंट रिप्लेसेबल विद आर्ड्यूनो नैनो बट जस्ट रिमेम्बर दैट इट पिन्स आर नॉट फाइव वोल्ट टॉलरेंट आर्ड्यूनो नैनो ई एस पी थर्टी टू पिन्स आर थ्री पॉइंट थ्री वोल्ट टॉलरेंट so here i am able to control all the loads from my mobile using arduino cloud iot application